Hey, how's it going? Sorry, sir? Oh, yes, sir. Yeah. Um, are you out here ex exercising your constitutional rights, sir? Yes, sir. Okay, that's what I'm here about. Now, cool. Um, have you been out here doing this before? This is my first time, sir. Okay. Is there anybody else out here with you today? No, sir. Just me, sir. Okay. Anybody else in the area today? No, sir. Okay. That's that's what I'm here. Just you're not planning on going any uh, grocery stores or anything of that way to do anything. No, sir. I will not be with? entering any private or federal businesses. Thank you, sir. Yes, sir. By chance, do you mind showing me some ID? I can do that, sir. If you don't mind. No. Yep. Just to let you know, it's um, I'm not obligated to. No, sir. I understand that. That's why I asked you if you don't mind. <laughs> yes, way, sir. If I get more calls, uh, absolutely, I can tell sir. Absolutely. The reason I was asking if you're right here with anyone else. Yes, sir. Or if you were, are you dressed the same? Um, no one else, sir. Okay. Just me, sir. And the reason I was asking that is, if I get somebody in a black shirt and green pants, I know it's you and not somebody else. Absolutely. Okay. Do you mind standing right here for just a minute? Absolutely. Thank you, sir. Appreciate you cooperating. Yes, no problem, sir. And obviously you're not a convicted felon. Yes, sir. Okay. Are you with me out here? No, sir. Hey, good afternoon. Hey, how's it going? That's a nice rifle you have. M and P. They make good stuff. I like going for this. Thank you, sir. Is that an aim point? Don't worry about it. Yeah. All right. Just trying to engage some fun conversation. Just friendly business out here, all exercising their Second Amendment rights today. Mr. Hess. Yes, sir. Is this your current address? Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. We've never met. I'm Sergeant Dillon. I work out of Precinct 4. Cool. This is uh, Officer Seebeck. All right. Nice to meet you, sir. You guys got some new squad cars recently, didn't you? We have one in this precinct. Cool. That's, that's probably the, that's the fancy unit, isn't it? Uh, it drives okay. Very nice, very nice. Stress, do you have a phone number? Uh, yes, sir. Do you have a cell phone number that's on your person? I do, sir. That if I called you right, you know, like 10 minutes from now, you can answer and talk to me? Yes, sir. All right, you can catch me on this cell phone at... See ya, baby. Which boy? Oh, hell no. The you didn't just touch my goddamn radio. The Beach Boys are great American music. The Beach Boys gonna get you a great ass whooping. Don't you ever touch a black man's radio, boy? You can do that in China, but you can get your ass killed out here, man. Mr. Hess, how far are you gonna be walking? Um, I am about six miles out, probably right now. Um, I see I've given you guys <laughs> quite a quite a fun day. We're gonna get calls. People are gonna call. We get calls on people with squirt guns. We get calls on people with uh, sticks that look like rifles. We get calls on everybody. I hear Did that. You start in Fulton County. Um, I started in uh, Cobb County. I'm over there, um, just a little bit further ways past Park Air, a um, little ways down, and uh, not too far out. What I'll probably what do. You said you walked six miles. Uh, just a guesstimation, sir. I, I haven't. Here to there, I haven't it's, clocked it. It's, it's not that far. <laughs> I don't think you, three, three, three Maybe miles. Maybe a mile and a half. All you right. Got, if you're Stop planning on doing up. six, you got you probably have to walk all the way to John uh, Shallow. Oh, I don't have a set mileage, and I oh, want to. Okay. If I'm only a mile and a half in, I want to give you guys another what, four and a half miles of trouble or anything uh, like that. I, I'd appreciate it. Um, like I said, we don't want to infringe on uh, any of your. Uh, Thank you, sir. Appreciate it. Have a good night. Rice. It's just the fact that we get calls. Yes, sir. And we have to respond. I understand. We sir. have to make sure that with. Um, with society the way it is, we yes, got to make sure that you are a person just exercising your rights and not some person Off that's the trying hinges. to do something yes, sir. Um, not good for society. Yes, sir. Okay. Fully understandable. All right. You have I just questions? wanted to see it. Oh, it's I, it's. I'm uh, for a hobby and uh, so I had to come over and see what you got. Because I saw it when I was in a patrol pass, I was like, oh, pretty nice. Thank you, sir. What uh, what kind of lower you got? Same extras. It's, um, yes, sir. I've got a. Um, uh, uh, POF Gen 3. Oh, very nice. Yeah, POF, I'm a big fan of their work. Um, and I've got an Adam's Arms uh, piston upper in it. Oh, very nice. I've been thinking about doing a SBR on POF. 
Oh, nice, nice. Just to let you know, um, their spacing in between the um, in between the front magwell on that um, takedown pin is a little bit wider than your typical spec. So you're probably going to have to go with a POF lower unless you're going to customize a little bit. Um, it took me a little while to find the spacer that was just just right because anything too big it wedges in there. Anything too small. Um, you'll have a little bit of play. It's a very, very fine amount of measurement, so it, it's it's hard. It's a nice ride, oh, thank you, sir. Um, yeah, I'm just a little ways down the road inside a Mulberry Farms subdivision. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Just left that area. Oh, very nice, very nice. All right. I mean, is that where you is that where you live? Yes, sir. Oh, okay. I didn't recognize the address. All right. But, okay. How close to the six miles is that? Because I know I mentioned Park Air being a little ways further down. How far from here is Mulberry? About two miles? Two to three. Two to three. And two. Right. Anyway, let me ask you one question. <laughs> Your stop. Yes, sir. It's very wide. Mm hmm. Wide. It's got uh, battery tubes in it. Um, I've got uh, four CR123 cells in there right now, which will go inside my Viridian light. Um, right now, it's just kind of tacked out as it would be. Um, that's just kind of how it how it runs. It's the uh, Magpul ACS. seat. Uh, you got the ACS on that one, don't you? It's either the I've got so much stuff in the rifle, I forget what it is. Either ACS or the yeah, ACS. CTR ACS. Yeah, I put that on the one I built for another guy. Oh, nice, nice. Two, two, Comfortable. Um, yes, sir. Well, I've got 5.56 in it right now. The chamber's empty. Uh, bolts in the back position, but the magazine's loaded with 40 rounds. Sir. Okay. Um, just. <laughs> it's it's gonna raise suspicion no matter what you do. <laughs> but at least at least we know who you are. You're, we're, we're yes, sir. Yeah, yeah. Doing. Give me a call. Um, I appreciate you dressing nice like this. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I've been waving, smiling to everybody. Um, I was about. Let's see. It took, I guess, about 15 minutes in before you guys caught me. So. Well, we've been getting calls, and we've been getting calls from different locations. Yeah. Uh, because people don't have enough sense to say, okay, I'm in front of this store. This is where I see them. They drive down the road by the time they call, they go, oh yeah, I'm at Johnson's Ferry in Roswell. You're four miles up the road. Yeah. So we were, that's the reason I was actually, there's more than one of you out here. Oh, I hear that. Uh, because we got a bunch of different calls. Oh, yeah. Now, by chance, you're <laughs> Six gentleman. different places at once. <laughs> there was a gentleman that was on Elk Road at 75, like two weeks ago. Um, no, sir. No relation. Okay. There was another gentleman. He was he, behaving himself, though? He was behaving himself. And Very nice. I appreciate it. It's just that that was down the area. I think we got, because that's in the city. Um, that's in the city, and the city had to handle it. So. Oh, I hear that. But anyway. All right. Well, very nice. Mr. Tess, I appreciate your cooperation. No problem uh, at all. Like I said, you know, if we ride by and we see you, we're going to wave at you. Because now I know who you are. Yes, okay. sir. So if I see you tomorrow or something like that. Yeah, this will probably be a one-time thing. Connecticut right now actually is having an open carry march outside their state capitol. Is it a, is it a like you said, Connecticut? Connecticut's having one today? Yeah, yeah. So is this like a, an organized across the country type deal? Well, it's specifically for Connecticut, but I couldn't quite make it down there due to short notice. Up there. Uh, well, yes, sir. Okay. Yes, sir. Yes, absolutely, sir. Okay. And uh, so I figured I'd just represent down here. and, and, and we, got, we got nicer weather for a walk anyway. <laughs> oh, absolutely. I couldn't have asked for a beautiful, more beautiful day. Um, so is there anything on, like, one of the websites saying everybody go out and do this today? You'll find some material on YouTube in regards to um, today being a day that uh, people in Connecticut are going out there and uh, having an armed protest. Has, like, typed in and said, hey, today in Georgia, Marietta. No, sir. Okay. Yeah, no relation to here. It's just something I decided to do because I couldn't make it out there. There might be others that had the same idea pop in your head, couldn't make it out, just felt like representing doing the same thing in their local area. But uh, as far as it being an organized deal where you guys would expect more people on uh, any real scale, um, you should not expect that here. Okay. That's... Unless other people have the same idea, and that would be a small scale thing. Make it. But anyway. I just got one other question for you. Yes, sir. I'm going to estimate you got about 1,800... Um, I paid too much for the lower, um, but with the accessories, everything as it stands right now, I've probably got uh, closer to three, oh, three thousand. Wow. Yeah, yeah. Um, I paid probably two hundred more than I should have for the lower, just because I got it. You know, post Sandy Hook, yeah. prices were just bad. 
Um, everything else I got at a pretty fair price. Uh, everything as it stands now is priced similarly as it was when I bought it then. Top-notch stuff on it. Yeah, yeah, I decked it out. I figured I'd swing for the fences. This is my first build. Looked up on YouTube yeah. how to do it. I was all excited. and It took me a good six, seven months to put it together. It's, it was, um, I'm not very, I'm not a rich person, but you know, over over time, I can, I can put some money into it. Yeah. Um, I go to a place called uh, Sandy Springs Gun, Gun Club and Range. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, they got good people up there. Over on, was it Roswell Road in, in Sandy Springs, or is it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's off Roswell Road and Sandy Springs up there. They got a nice range. It's owned by uh, two females. They they run it all right. They got some nice nice layout up there. Isn't there uh, outdoor rifle range? I think it's north on like I don't want to say Florence, but like Buford Highway or something. You go north and like up towards Cumming. I, I might a gun club up that way. I might need to look into I that. Even, I can't even think about where it is. I I went to a soccer game pick up my kid and I remember riding by and looking off and you could see it set up off to the right and it was it was way north. Was it a long long range? It looked like it. Oh nice I need to get into that because I'm only sighted in at 35 yards I'd have to hold yeah. I'd have to hold probably a bit um, a bit low much past much past that. I'm real I can't even really take a shot past 50 yards right now I'm not sighted in for it I wouldn't do it. Alright well Mr. Hess enjoy the day enjoy your day Yes. Take have care. a good one. Take care, guys. I'll probably head back. Um, I'll just be going in this direction. I'll head back home. Um, I've done the protest. I put in the work, and uh, I don't want to, you know, tie you guys up too much today. I'm sure you have good things to do. So. Uh, yeah. People, you know, people are on edge. Yeah, and that's part of it. Just trying to advertise, show people that not everyone exercising their rights or, or with a firearm is a, is a Looney Tune. You know, and that's kind of part of it. The public awareness. A lot of people don't even know they have the right to keep and bear arms to defend themselves, and it's a. It's a real shame because we're the only nation that has such a uh, such a phenomenal and beautiful right, and so many people just don't even know. You know, they associate firearms with you know evil crimes and stuff, and they don't know that people defend themselves lawfully every day. Yep. All right. But anyway. Hey, will you guys have a good one. Take care. I won't type any more of your time. Thank you, sir. Appreciate it. Take care.